sa Atienza. Verushao definitely displaying a team effort dito sa set number one. Exactly. And you see with Kalaokan when everybody thought that it will be an instant win for Kalaokan. Here comes um, Binyan. But again, Kalaokan showing mastery. Nandi nila nila on the second set. Yaya Gabarda really very effective in the middle. But Binyan here, nakumkuha na ng konting momentum. We see some points from Jurel Singh and Laika Lanaria. But eventually, despite having more errors, Kalaokan appeared to be victorious and getting the second set, second set here in this match. Pagdating naman ng third set dito na, syempre, ito nga yung sinasabi ko na it has been a story, you know, of exchanges yes. when it comes to points, when it comes to offense and defense. Set number two, this is when Lanaria was able really to contribute a lot, you know, and operate the goods for Binyan. Pagdating ng set number three, nakita natin, you know, it was Binyan able to take on or makalamang sa unang part of that game. Pero, you know, umahabol man ang kalookan. But still, this is the set na nakita natin yeah. na talagang nabuhay ang Binyan. This is their first set win. And uh, of course, although there were a couple of errors here na bawi na Manila when it comes to their offense, strong. And of course, the coverage that we've been talking to sa first set and second set na kailangang improve ng Binyan na improve nila, especially on the blocking Sia and Eric Alguino started to hit up on the third set, resulting for 25 over 23 here in favor for Binyan. That's right. Set number four, nakakalamang dito sa umpisa ang Kalookan where they led as high as four points. But after that second technical timeout, dito hinahabol. That's five straight points for Binyan wherein they were able to tie the game at 17. At ito nga, parang nag-back to zero. You know, unahan sa pagagawa dito ng puntas. And definitely, it was another effort displayed here. And I mentioned every time na humahabol itong Binyan, it was the tandem of Nasol and Cecilio, you know, um, playing on the court at they are really uh, talagang nagagawa yung role nila, role na inaasahan sa kanila ng coach. 25-22 is the score. Last set. Ito na, nakita natin yung momentum that was, uh, that Binyan able to sustain from the fourth continues, yes. continued to the fifth set. Tama ka dyan. And of course, what really works here for Binyan is yung rotation na I believe Coach Edwin recognized when Lanaria and Jurel Singh is magkasama sa attack line. It gave um, Kaloka a hard time para basahin kung sino ba yung atake at e-score for Binyan.